Free to succeed. Raid Shadow Legends video. Um, guaranteed Legendary Edition. Um, you know. Whatever, dude. Probably don't. Probably don't. Probably don't do it. If you're if you're wondering what I think about it, save it for the champ chase. Is there a champ chase live right now? What's what's even live right now? <clears throat> we got a champ training. Spider, we're done with. How about the champ training? Forty-two twenty-five. Well, that seems like an interesting number. Okay, fine. How about another uh, another dungeon divers? And that's it. <clears throat> champ chase, champ training, and a dungeon divers. Okay, fine. Cool, great, fine. Nothing even on the schedule? Like, nothing even, like, opening in 13 hours or something? Hey, hurry up. <laughs> hurry up and give me the events. I'm ahead of the game here. Hurry up. Alright, what do we get here? What do we get? A void shard. And... An epic book? Sounds fine. I'll take it. I'll take it. And we get to use Geomancer today. That'll be fun. Assuming he's all good to go. Um, Alright, let's add our point in here. So, almost there. Almost there, dude. And then we can move on. Just got a lot of arena to grind. Now I think I can grab my stuff, right? Yeah! Is Geomancer ready to go? He is. Let's hit him with a few glyphs while we're here. <clears throat> I mean, we don't have many to hit him with, but hit him with what we got, you know? That max roll though. Get off me, dog. <laughs> that max roll on the three star. So yesterday. No, give me at least a three. Yesterday I was rolling. I can't remember which glyphs it was, but the range was like, I think the range is eight to 20. It's it's some flat stat glyph where the range is like eight to 20. And I was rolling, it, it, it must be flat attack because that's who I was going through and glyphing. That's what I was going through in glyphing yesterday. I think it's a four-star flat attack glyph. That's like eight to twenty, right? That makes sense, right? So I'm going through and I'm glyphing a bunch of flat attack, and I remember there was a se there was a sequence across a few champs because <clears throat> I was like I, I just go through the gear and as I was closing, I go into another, and it was it was I rolled 11, 11, 11. And then I rolled different glyph, different stat. And then I came back to fly attack and rolled 11. And then I rolled 11 on the next piece. And I was like, no, you know what? I'm tired of rolling 11s. So I did it again and it went red because it rolled 11 again. <laughs> it's like, um. Just seems like it's not as random as it as it is made out to be is my point. Okay, that's all I'm saying. Or I just hit the lottery. Either way. Yeah, we're going to run a Geo Key today and see how it goes. Probably not in this episode, but... You know what I'm saying? Like... We'll see how it goes. Okay, man. Um, we, we can... I don't think we can beat Bommel. Uh, not Bommel. Uh, the Scarab here. I, I mean, I... Perhaps I could come up with a team, actually. <clears throat> that could... Are there any teams in here that aren't speed teams that people are using? I'm always curious about what people are doing. Rogni Stag, Allure. That's a fun one. Yeah, I mean, we really just need the shields, right? It's really not that complicated. We got our Drock. We got Duchess. 
that God seeker. She could extend the shields. Isn't there some new accessory, newish accessory or something called blood shield or something? Is that right? Am I making that up or is that a real thing? That's revenge, reaction, revenge. I'm not even sure if I have any. Revenge, there's just lots of revenge and reaction. The way that this skips when you scroll it, it is really unreasonable. It really isn't fair how upset it makes me. Gives wear shield worth 5% of damage dealt after attacking. Yeah. Blood shield. I wasn't making it up. It is a real thing. Um. <clears throat> And then we need someone with destroy. Who, who has my destroy? I think I have my armager in destroy. If I'm not mistaken, he's in destroy. And then I reckon stag is not a bad candidate for this, right? I just don't know if that's enough shield. Geomancer is kind of good for everything. Stag might help us though. I'm gonna let them auto, and then like as they as they begin to wrap up the second wave, I'll pop in and start hitting a ones on everybody. Um, so we can go in with our full cooldowns and stuff, you know. How convenient. Does he specifically steal block debuffs? Or just one random buff? I thought it was one random buff. Can't remember. How convenient for him. He stole the block debuffs off three champs though, right? Feels about as random as those glyphs I was talking about. Well, he's got revive on death, so it's going to be stupid to kill him right now, huh? You know, <clears throat> this one might be another example of when we full auto just because of Duchess, honestly. I'm not, I guess I'm entirely convinced he can kill Duchess. She's going to keep shield on herself, so he's not going to be counterattacking her all the time. I don't know that I think he can strip her. So this may be one that just takes a really long time and we win because of Duchess. <laughs> So far, they're doing pretty well, though. Like as a as a as a team. All right, well, a one Berg down. When does he strip? Is it is it one of his cooldown skills that he strips? Or is it just his A1? Oh, it's a shame that, that Drock is not um, faster than Godseeker, though. And it's a shame there's no shield set. That's a tad unfortunate. That means right out of the gate we're going to catch a counterattack. That might be a problem. 
Like if, if we catch a counterattack right out of the gate and, and he puts provoke on Drock, we're gonna be screwed. Unless I'm right about Duchess. <laughs> yeah, I guess if that's the case, then I might as well just let them auto and see what happens. That's what I'm gonna do. We're just gonna let him auto and see what happens. I mean, we lucked out with the Duchess pull for sure, but we also happen to have some pretty nice gear. I think this is a pretty solid Duchess build, honestly, for, for a free-to-play account, for where this one is anyway. I was pretty pleased with the stats we were able to get on her. She is definitely carrying us through uh, a, a few things. Somebody got your Carl. Dude, your Carl looks so cool to be so unpopular. I feel like I would like to pull one, if I'm going to be honest. I think he's a cool champ. I think he'd be fun to do some stuff with. <clears throat> and he's just so freaking cool looking, dude. Actually, <clears throat> we will we will try to go in here with fresh off cooldowns. If she puts up block debuffs. I don't remember when he provokes. If it's after the, sh I don't I don't remember exactly. Honestly, it's it's a lot to. Remember, and I have not spent a bunch of time in here messing with Doom Tower stuff. But we'll go in with cooldowns and then just let them roll. See what happens. We've got to destroy. I'm pretty. Yeah, armor just got to destroy. So we should be able to get, if we stay alive, we can get rid of that shield. See how it goes. Okay, so. Attacks all enemies. Each extra hit. Places an extra hit for each buff. Moves one. Steals from enemies that have no shield. Removes from enemies that do have shield. Okay. Okay, so we should be safe to do this. <clears throat> And then I'm gonna I'm gonna hold on to her extend. So we're just gonna do this. And then Drock should be able to get the shield up. And now he might steal them, but or, or remove them, but at least he won't steal them, I guess. Fuck. I guess I'm just gonna let him auto, dude. <clears throat> we'll see how it goes. Let's see if my theory is right about Duchess. I don't think he can strip anything off Duchess. I don't think he can kill Duchess. Might be a pretty long fight, especially with as hard as it seems like it's going to be for armor to get turns. It says he had shield, but <laughs> I didn't see it, dude. Wow. Maybe he can kill Duchess, actually. Come on, Drog, put some shields up. Oh my god, dude. 
I noticed he stole a revive on death. Would that work? Would he would he actually revive on death? really a shame Armager didn't get that turn first. That would have been nice. Because ask me if I think that fear is going to proc. Still kind of seems like they, they might do it. We might have to end this episode before they do it. Because uh, it, it might take them 20 more minutes. Um, I reckon I'll let you know in the stream. If you're dying to know if, if they win this run, come over to the stream at <laughs> twitch.tv slash jgigs. It'll probably still be going by the time I start the stream. So you might get to see him win it live. Um, but that'll be it, man. We'll wrap this one up here. I appreciate you guys watching. Hope you have a good one.